Hey everybody, we're in the middle of Blaine's gym here. We can go ahead and uh, take a look at the Pokemon. We're about to go fight the gym leader. So, uh, Starmie 52, Nita King 47, uh, Pidgeot 43. Kabuto's about to evolve to 40, but I took the XP share off and gave it to Rhyhorn. Because there's going to be a lot of good battles coming up, and I don't want to hit 40 in the middle of one. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Ooh, wait, there's trivia machines. Can I... Can I not use the trivia machines? Alright, well, ooh, wait, what about the painting? It's a photo of Blaine and Mr. Fuji. They're standing shoulder to shoulder. I am Blaine, the red-hot leader of Cinnabar Gym. My fury Pokemon are all rough and ready with intense heat. They'll, they'll incinerate all challengers. You better have burn heal. Um... I'm a starfish, so... I think I'll be fine. Alright, Growlithe. And luckily, I still have a lot of PP. Because what I basically did was just use, um... This pulse, Water Pulse. And I still have plenty of Surfs, so... Um, I'm basically just gonna quite literally drown all his Pokemon, and it's gonna be wonderful. And that was even a critical hit. Okay. Arcanine. Cool. I haven't seen an Arcanine before. It's a pretty cool Pokemon you got there, bud. Um, but I will be drowning it. That is a level 47, though. That's pretty high. You know, Starmie's only 52, so it's not that far away. Ponyta. Okay. And, like, he brought out... Um... Brought out a, his, one of his better ones. Or a little early. Yeah, his Arcanine was the strongest one. I'm surprised he pulled it out as, as a second Pokemon. Alright, Rapidash. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I'll need to get one of those myself soon enough, hopefully. Super effective. Alright, Rhyhorn, level 26. Player defeated, later Blaine. I have burned down to nothing, not even ashes remain. You have earned the Volcano Badge. And earned a smooth 9k. Ha! The Volcano Badge heightens the special stats of your Pokémon. Here, you can have this too. Received... what is that? Um, Fire Blast. Don't waste it on water Pokémon. Okay. Um, cool. Which reminds me, let's go to our TM case. And... Let's take a look. Blizzard. Can we put it on... Okay, we can put it on Starmie. Okay, yes. Yes, and let's go ahead and forget Water Pulse. We have Surf. We don't need two Water uh, Attack types. And this way, you know, we have Ice, Water, Psychic, and Thunder, which is super sick. Um, Giga Drain, we don't need that. Solar Beam, no. Fire Blast. Who can learn Fire Blast? Needle King can learn Fire Blast? I think, let's go ahead and forget Thrash. I really like Thrash, but I think diversifying his move pool will help a lot. And especially having Fire Blast, that's pretty sick. Um, Steel Wing. Oh wait, we can probably give Steel Wing to Pidgeot, yes. Go ahead and give Pidgeot Steel Wing. No. Yes. Um... We can go ahead and get rid of Wing Attack. Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of Wing Attack. Just because Aerial Ace is slightly better. Alright, Steel Wing. Um, I think we're good as far as that goes. Yeah, okay. Cool. Well, we are good to go. We learned a couple new moves. Um... Uh, Kabuto's almost there. Now we're gonna start getting Rhyhorn up. So let's go ahead and get out of the gym and... Um, yes. Huh? Hey! If it isn't red, 
Look, it's me, Bill, long time no see. I hope you're still using my PC system. Well listen, since we met up here, how about spending some time with me? There's this little island in the far south called One Island. My friend invited me, so I'm on my way out there. How about it, do you feel like coming with me? Not yet. What, are you too busy? Well, alright, the boat hasn't arrived yet anyway. I'll be waiting at the Pokemon Center over there. Come see me when you're done with your business here. So, we can actually go with him. I just want to do one very quick thing. Um, I want to check on the Pokemon that we left at the daycare center, just because I'm curious. We left them there a little while ago. So, just because I'm curious. Have you heard about Bill? Oh, we literally just talked to him. Let's go ahead and put a Pokemon in. Um, deposit. Let's deposit Execute just for now into box 7. And let's go grab the Pokemon that we left at the daycare center. Um, I totally forgot who we left there. But, I guess we will see. Is it going to be cut? Yes, let's go ahead and cut it. I totally forgot who we left there, but hopefully it's someone cool. Um, okay, Bell Sprout. You're. Oh. 17? Um. Okay. Let's. I forgot that. It's probably one of the Pokemon that we traded from the other game. Oh, Ekans, of course. Okay, when does Ekans evolve? Um, Ekans level evolution. When does it evolve? 22. Okay, we left it in there a little too long. Um. Let's go ahead and. Hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and give him Borsi. Why not? Um, it might be a little bit of a waste, because we might find a, l a bigger Horsey later. Um, but let's go ahead and give him Horsey. Okay. Um, and then let's go out and let's level somewhere. Just so we can level up Kabuto and Ekans. Actually, so let's just go level up at the mansion. Why not? I think that's probably the easiest place to go anyway. And honestly, I might also evolve some Pokemon using stones too. So let's just... We're gonna probably rapid fire some evolutions here. Here we go. Alright, Ekans grew to level 29. So this should be an evolution. Yep, and again, he was supposed to, supposed to evolve at 22. Um, I left him in there for maybe a little too long. Um, but that's completely okay. That just means we have an Arbok that's, you know, a little higher level, just in case we want to use them, which we won't. But... Alright, we got ourselves... An Arbok. Your E evolved into Arbok. And again, E is the nickname because I just was spamming in Fire Red and just named him something random. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, take that from him. Let's go ahead and give it to Kabuto. And then we need to get Kabuto 40, and he'll evolve. Alright, one more battle. Um, we need one more battle, and the Kuputa... Kabu... Alright, I can't say that word, apparently. One more. And we go ahead and evolve that. Now, I don't think I have, like, any PP left. Alright, we can use a Thunder here. Okay, good, it didn't miss. And then once this Vulpix goes down, we get our very coveted Kabutops evolution. There we go, Kabuto level 40. And we get, in one, in my opinion, one of the absolute coolest evolutions in the game. I'm very tempted to actually use Kabuto in my final six. I'm very tempted, but we'll see. I know, I don't think he's like super strong, that's the problem. But, he's a very cool looking Pokemon. Congrats, your Kabuto evolved into Kabutops. Um, is trying to learn Slash, but, um, yes. Yes, let's go ahead and do that. We can go get, go ahead and get rid of Leer. I don't need Leer. And Kabutops is a Water Rock, which is super, super cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and run into the Pokem Center. And we're gonna do some, like, pretty speed fire, um, evolutions here. Um, let's go ahead and drop Ekans in Box 1, Kabutops in... Wait, 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 wait. I need to take the item off Kabutops real quick. Okay. Let's go ahead and deposit 
Kabutops. Let's just say in box seven. Put Needle King box seven. Pidgeot in box seven. Now we're gonna grab a bunch of Pokemon that evolve with stones. So let's kind of go through them. Um, all right, let's go ahead and grab Clefairy. We can grab Pikachu. We can grab... Uh, who else evolves with a stone? I think that's it for this page. We can grab Vulpix. We can grab... Who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Um... I think we're good on that page. Um... Oh, yes, we can grab our Weepin' Bell. That is another one. Okay, and last one, we'll go ahead and grab our Clefairy here. And we should be able to evolve every single one of these with a stone. Now, the only problem is we need one more Moonstone. But very super luckily, we actually have one more Moonstone. Not very far away from us. If we go into the Pokemon Mansion, if we go to this small rock here... Moonstone. Okay, so this next one's gonna take a little while because we're literally evolving five separate Pokemon, but um, we will go one by one. So two Moonstones, we can go ahead and use it on the Clefairy and the Jigglypuff. So let's go ahead and get both of these evolutions. Moonstone was used on Clefairy. I'm actually like almost just like tempted to just like meet myself for like 15 minutes while we evolve all these. These evolutions take quite a little while, but... So we evolved our Clefairy into... Bang. Congrats, your Clefairy evolved into a... Ooh, evolved into a Clefable. Alright, other Moonstone. Over to Jigglypuff. What? Jigglypuff is evolving? And our Jigglypuff is gonna turn into a Wigglytuff. Congrats, your Jigglypuff evolved into a Wigglytuff. Cool. Now we can head down... Maybe head up, actually. Into our stones. Oh, I think we get a Fire Stone. We can evolve the Vulpix. What? Vulpix is evolving? Yup. And I might have had a higher level Vulpix on accident, but honestly, it's not that big of a deal. I'm not going to be using it. This is simply Pokedex filler. That's it. Alright, we got ourselves a Ninetales. Congrats, your Vulpix evolved into a Ninetales. And we'll have to do the same with the Growlithe. Which I don't think I have yet, so I'll have to grab one. Alright, we can use a Thunderstone on Pikachu here. The original Pikachu we caught back all the way in the forest at like episode 2. What? Pikachu's evolving. So yeah, this Pikachu's probably only the second or third or fourth Pokemon that I ever caught in this playthrough, which is pretty cool. Alright, we got ourselves a Raichu. Cool. Alright, who do we have? Who do we have left? Um, we have... So we need a Leaf Stone? Oh yeah, that's only one more. Just need a Leaf Stone. And we can evolve Weeping Bell into Victory Bell. And bang. Congratulations, your Weeping Bell evolved into a Victory Bell. Cool. So let's take a look at the Pokemon we just evolved. We got Clefable, Raichu, Ninetales, Victory Bell, and Wigglytuff. So that's pretty cool. Five new Pokedex entries in like basically five minutes. Alright, we can go ahead and deposit all of them. We will no longer use basically any of them. So go ahead and put them all away. Victory Bell's kind of cool. Maybe we'll use him later, but... Alright, withdraw. Let's go ahead and take back... Um, 
I don't think I'm going to bot. Yep. So Needle King, Pidgeot. We'll grab Rhyhorn. We will grab Execute. Then we need one more Pokemon. Okay, and the last one, we will go grab, go ahead, and grab a Coughing. Um, because that one in Leaf Green, you have to evolve. In Fire Red, you can find them, but in Leaf Green, you have to evolve. So, I think we're basically good to go. Um, this is what our Pokemon are looking like. Let's go ahead and give Rhyhorn the XP share. And now we are ready to go to the islands. Pretty sure. Let me triple check. Alright, yep. Anything else that we need to do, we'll just do when we come back. Um, really not that big of a deal. Hey, you kept me waiting. Ready to set sail to one island? Yes. Well, that's it. Let's go. Do do do. Do do do. Alright, Bill. Me and you. Homies forever. Looks like my pal's boat arrived, too. He sent it specially here to Cinnabar to pick me up. Let's go, let's go do... Let's, let's go vacation. Here. Here we are. This is one island. There are several islands around here, and this is one of them. My friend Celio sent the boat to fetch me here. He's in charge of the island's PC network by his lonesome. Why am I telling you this now? Let's just go see Celio. Hey! Bill, I can't believe you came out here. Well, absolutely. How's your research coming along? Oh, wait a second. Red, this is my buddy Celio. He's one dedicated PC maniac. This is Red, a rising contender as the Pokemon champ. That's really impressive. I hate to say it, but I have zero aptitude for battling. Anyways, I'm glad to meet you. So bring me up to speed. How's your machine running? It's running fine, but we're too remote out here. The PCs on this island just can't link with your PC, Bill. Oh, yeah? Well, let me take a look-see. Hang on here. I think we can make it work. Let me help you, okay? Red, can I get you to wait for me just a bit? Actually, can I get you to do me a favor? The island next to this one's called Two Island. There's a guy there that runs a game corner. He has this thing for rare rocks and gems. We keep in touch, being fellow maniacs. So can I get you to deliver this meteorite to him? Cool. Red, if you're going to Two Island, please take this. Ooh, a tri-pass. Okay. It's a pass for the ferry service serving the local islands. It will let you travel between the islands 1, 2, and 3. Oh, you should have this too. Okay, an extra page for the town map. I'll catch you later. Say hi to this to guy for me. You now, question. Can we use the PC? We can't. Well, then it's a very good thing <laughs> that we grabbed the Pokemon that we wanted to evolve beforehand all right well let's go let's go take a look around first all right so off of this coast we can go ahead and go but let me go ahead and check the town map okay so we're on island one we can go down to treasure beach up to mount ember island two and island three okay and also just because i'm curious check our pokedex so we have owned 110 and seen 132. Let's do it numerically. So, yeah, basically five of the ones are just starters. So we'll have to grab. We still need a Butterfree, Kakuna, Beedrill. And then this is where we start getting into most that we have. We need Needle Queen, Queen still. We need Venomoth. We never caught Venomoth at the Safari Zone, really? I must have just forgot about it. Okay, so we're not missing really too many. We still need a Shelter and Cloister, Hypno. Okay, so there are still a few that we need to grab, but not a crazy amount. Okay, interesting. Oh, so I step out and okay. So nothing useful here. Um. Okay. Okay, really not 
nothing interesting from those guys, surprisingly. Okay. Nothing very interesting with any of these people. Um, let me quickly open up my little guide here for, um... So, Route 21, we went past, so we're good. Island 1. So, there's nothing really we can grab here. So, on Treasure Beach, we can find a Persian, which we need. Cool, I think there's... Is there just one trainer? Lying back, rocked by waves, it's exquisite. Is there only one trainer here? Looks like it's just one trainer. Swimmer Amara. We defeated Amara. Um. Alright. Good things get washed up by the ocean current onto this beach. That's why I off, off a come here. Some beach combing. Okay. So this is where we're looking for a Persian. I think that's the only thing we really need from here. Because we have Slowpoke, Meowth, Hero... Pangala, yeah, we just need the Persian. Um, but we're also looking for stuff. So I don't know if we have to... Use the item finder, maybe? Alright, here we go! We got a Persian. Level 40, that's pretty high, actually. Um... Okay, I don't particularly want to kill it. Let's go ahead and switch over to Pidgeot. And... Pidgeot will probably not kill it, which is pretty important for the whole catching process. Let's go ahead and use a quick attack. It shouldn't hurt it too bad. Okay, but we did critical. Okay, well, um, I think that's good enough for me. Let's go ahead and start. Um, I'll save my Ultra Balls. Let's just go ahead and throw some Great Balls. and Because we're never going to use Great Balls again, really. So let's go ahead and use them and kind of get them... Not over with, but let's, you know, let's get them out of our inventory here. No reason to just, like, keep them and never use them. Okay, three. There we go, we got ourselves the Persian. And once again, that is the only thing we need. So, um, there's nothing on the island. Although its fur has many admirers, it is tough to raise as a pet because of its fickle meanness. Yeah, Persian's probably kind of a wiener. Um, so, I don't know, do I have to use the item finder, or do they literally show up on the beach? Okay. Well, how do I know where it is buried? Okay, a little, little upwards. Oh, put an Ultra Ball in our pocket. Okay. Well, that's cool. Is there another one? Okay, there is another one. Okay, anywhere? Ah, we found Stardust. Okay. Guess we can just keep walking around to find stuff. Um, okay, never mind. We're gonna go ahead and go. Alright, let's, um, jump on the ferry to Island 2. Ahoy there, where do you want to sail? Okay, let's go ahead and go to Island 2. And then we should be able to... I don't know where we're looking for this guy, but, um... We're gonna go ahead and end the episode off here, guys. So, thanks for watching.